YouTube, what up, man? It's Cut It. You know what I'm saying? Man, I finally got this put together for y'all. I want y'all to check it out. Uh, only thing I got left to do is take this to the lineman shop. Go into the lineman shop in the morning. You know what I'm saying? I got everything put together on it. I'm super satisfied with the work. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I, I, you know what I'm saying? I can't be more happy. Y'all see the recut. Recut amazing. No tape. Y'all know how I do it. Somebody had said something about the spring. Well, I went back and redone everything. You know, I had the cup on the top the other day. So I messed around and put the cup on the bottom. I got the cup anchored down. Let me see if I can get in there. I'll show you what I'm talking about. I got the cup anchored down. It's a boat in it. See that boat in the middle down there? I got a boat in it. The anchor, the cup down so the cup won't move. Them the stock springs. Stock springs in there. I changed the angle. You know what I'm saying? Now the angle is, is something I'm more comfortable with. No spaces on the back. You see it. Uh, I got all inside the fenders detailed out like I do it. Y'all yeah, know how I do detailing stuff. Everything shiny, glossy in there. Everything big glossy. Stretch in there. You see the clearance. You see the clearance on the strip pan. No spaces in the strips. And this is a redo, by the way. It ain't like I just done this from scratch. Like, this is a redo. So, you know what I'm saying? You see that cut it cut on there? Focus in there. You know. Okay, got that cut it cut now. Clean. All the fenders come down. It ain't got no slant angle to it. You get what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, man, I got them tires adjusted in. But I still got to take the car to the alignment. If you really pay attention uh, to it, it has a little kick in the front. But it's going to the alignment shop. I'm going to see Bobby tomorrow. Y'all know Bobby the man. Bobby the goat at what he do. I got, uh, I got the front situated where I can adjust the camera how I want to. I just figured, you know what I'm saying, why... Spend my time trying to adjust the camera when Bobby finna do it anyway. So, uh, you know what I'm saying? The front gonna be camber. You know what I'm saying? The camera gonna be better tomorrow. And uh, the back got that same little kick to it. It's just little, little fine adjustments. Like I said, man, once again, you see that cut it cut. And this is a recut. Like, I don't even know if I zoomed in on the fenders for y'all to actually see the fenders before. But this is the after effect. You get what I'm saying? This they cut it cut. All the way around. No discrepancy. And this car been plastic dipped. So you know what I'm saying? I cut a car that's been plastic dipped and it still didn't knock the paint off. Now some of these little spots like the paint was already chipping so I trimmed a little more so it didn't look crazy. But yeah man, y'all see it. Man, even though, despite what I went through with this car, like, man, this car was fun. It was a learning experience. You get what I'm saying? I got some new tricks up my sleeve. I put some new tricks in the bag just because of this car. You feel what I'm saying? And, uh, hey, you know what I'm saying? It's motor calm. Like I said, man, I, I ain't even going to get the whole thing. I ain't going to get the whole thing. Just know this. I got another one. This a max this time. But, uh, man, y'all get down in the comment section and y'all just guess what this maximum going on. Just guess, man, for real. Like, uh, only thing, I'm, I'm, I'm going to put it up there like this. First in the world. That's all I'm going to say about this car. First in the world. So, yeah, I ain't going to give y'all the whole thing. We're going to keep it up top. And I'm going to switch it back around. But, yeah. Yeah, man, they go to Altima, and I got his big brother right here on my left. So, yeah, man, I just really wanted to give y'all a, a good walk around of the Altima, man, because this car was a long time coming. Long time coming. Now, the tires look pretty good, but it got some adjusting to be done on it. I know how them, them Nissans and Infinities, man. I be seeing y'all with them back tires sticking out at the top. I be seeing you. I know who y'all live. 
And this is just this is just me. You know what I'm saying? This off this off the top. This off site right here. This is what I'm doing off site. We ain't even want to hit the alignment shop yet. And then I ain't even try on the front because I'm going straight to the alignment shop. There's no need for me to put all that in, all that effort into something Bobby finna do anyway. I'm gonna let Bobby be great and Bobby do what he do. Man, the car running, running smooth, running good. You know what I'm saying? That's that walk around. Man, let me see if I get the tie size in here, man, so y'all can see. There it is, right on the top. Look at that. 275, 25, 28. Yes, sir. Y'all see it, man. Like I said, this is a this is a redo for me. You get what I'm saying? Like I'm I'm redoing something. The car had 26s on it. And it barely had the 26s on it. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, you know. It was some stuff done to it, you know what I'm saying? Somebody probably on their way up, they, you know what I'm saying? They learning, but you know what I'm saying? I got years and years of experience, man. This Cut It Customs YouTube channel, this is new, but I've been out here for years and years and years, man. I got experience, you know what I'm saying? I don't put everything on everything, and a lot of, you know what I'm saying? I was the first person to bring it to Alabama, you know what I'm saying? Stuff that we were seeing, you know what I'm saying, that, 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 Nobody could produce the results for, like in Alabama, I was bringing it to the table. And, uh, man, you know, I'm, well, I'm one of the people, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's one other person, you know what I'm saying, that's been out here in Alabama lifting cars just as much as I do. I have all the respect in the world for this man, you know what I'm saying? We we bumped in each other at Magic City Classic one year, you know what I'm saying? And uh, I'm like, dang, I ain't put the rims on that car, and I know when he seen my car, he was thinking the same thing. So, you know what I'm saying, that's, that's how we met. But, you know, hey, man, I got plenty of respect for dude. I know he been out here grinding and hustling just like I have. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you know what I'm saying? I, I give respect when respect do. But, yeah, man, y'all see this thing, bro. Clean, right, perfect. But it's not had no problems out of this car. You know what I'm saying? Ride quality going to be A1, like factory. Now, he didn't come from this. When he pulled up, you know what I'm saying? He had that. He had that. Old school ride quality, like having some big block springs and a cutlass. Y'all, y'all know what they, y'all know what they feel like. You know what I'm saying? But man, I got them back pillow riding. You know what I'm saying? Everything cool. Shouldn't be making no noises or popping and grinding and none of that. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, man, tomorrow, uh, when I'm probably leaving from the alignment shop where I know everything real perfect. You know what I'm saying? I'ma probably shoot a video in the car driving highway speeds. You know what I'm saying? And doing some turns and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Just letting y'all see on the inside of what something like this could ride. Like, I'm going to hit some railroad tracks. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm possibly going to do some stuff like that for y'all. Now, y'all get down there in the comment section, man, and tell me what would y'all want to see me do in this car. You know what I'm saying? I'm with it. I'm trying to show y'all that it's a different way. I'm trying to show y'all that, you know what I'm saying, it, it's possible to get factory-like results out of out of, out of these, you know what I'm saying, type of bills and stuff like that, you know what I'm saying, but I got a, I got a video with me, uh, riding in that squatted g body, uh, pulling into the gas station, you know what I'm saying, articulation off of the highway onto the, in, onto the, into the gas station parking lot, you know what I'm saying, no rub, no scrub, no nothing, man, if y'all want to see that video, man, if y'all want me to post that video, man, uh, man, let's do this, uh, let me get a hundred likes on this one. I get a hundred likes on this video, man. I'm gonna start posting some inside, out the in, inside and outside the car videos. Where like, uh, I'm driving. Might put a cup of water on the dashboard. I feel like I can do that in my cars. You feel me? I had tried that before, and <laughs> I'm assuming there's some people that 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 wasn't producing the results that I uh was producing. They they weren't feeling me put, <clears throat> putting up videos like that because. You know what I'm saying? They like, man, how is, how is dude able to, you know what I'm saying, get these cars to dry that good? He can put a cup of water on the dashboard. But, hey, man, you know what it is, man. I'm going to give y'all what y'all want to see. So, man, like I said, uh, let me get 100 likes in this video. I'm going to post a cutlass video if that's what y'all want to see. Man, y'all drop down in that comment section, man, and just tell me some stuff y'all want to see me do in this car. You turn you know what I'm saying? Uh, it's going to rain tomorrow. I'm, I know I'm going to be driving it in the rain. I know a lot of these Nissans with this rear camber issue, the Nissans and Infinities with this rear camber issues, they have problems driving in the rain. 
because they riding on the edges outside edges of the tires instead of riding you know what i'm saying flat and uh they don't have enough uh contact patch on the ground to be able to drive and the car perform like you're supposed to in the rain as you can see the contact patch is already good that's full contact patch on the ground but you know what i'm saying like i said it's probably gonna get even better than this man these little raindrops don't start falling man and i gotta shoot across town i need to let these windows up on some of these cars i'm working on so man i'm gonna keep my motto the same baby good work y'all be on the lookout for the alignment videos for this car and the riding footage of this car good work